Hey guys, Paradise here. Arix is away over with the guys at Capcom. He's just finished doing a stream showing off some of the upcoming Devil Joe content, which means we can show you guys some spicy new information. We've got the new Devil Joe Greatsword, the new Devil Joe Alpha armor set, and we've also got a new mantle that no one really knew about, which is the Dragonproof Mantle. So first off, to show you guys the new Greatsword Anguish, this is the Devil Joe Greatsword with roughly 1100 attack. It has sharpness which shows white, but that is because as we'll get into a minute, the armor set has handicraft on it. With a negative 30% affinity, quite a big negative affinity there, 240 dragon elemental attack and high elder seal on this weapon. This is looking like a powerful greatsword. It is definitely not a raw damage greatsword. It has that dragon elemental damage on it. And it is the only second weapon that looks like it has high elder seal on it next to the Nergagante weapons. Definitely one to keep our eye on. This weapon also gives a good indication of what the other different types of weapons stats will be like. So they're probably all going to be negative affinity, dragon elemental, high elder seal weapons. It will be interesting to see if this can break some of the non-elemental decoration meta. Then next up we have the Devil Joe Alpha armor set. This armor set on the helmet has part breaker and handicraft. On the body it has speed eating and handicraft. On the gloves it has latent power 2 and part breaker. On the waist it has latent power and handicraft and on the legs it has speed eating two and part breaker so this whole set is going to have innately three levels in part breaker three levels in handicraft three levels in speed eating and three levels in latent power so this is going to be a really interesting mix up for some of the handicraft items in the game and it's going to be quite an interesting set indeed and then finally we have the new mantle the dragon proof mantle in the stream they said that the mantle will give you increased dragon resistance but also increased dragon damage so this is going to actually be a mantle that you can use against elder dragons and dragon weak creatures to get dragon resistance and a boost to your dragon damage this will be a really interesting mix up for different elemental dragon builds and I really look forward to trying this and seeing how it tries out in actual gameplay. Guys you can check out the link in the description over to the official Monster Hunter Twitch page where you can watch the entire VOD of the stream but this roundup pretty much shows you all the new things in the update. I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope you'll click that like button, let me know in the comments what you are most excited for in this Devil Joe update, hit that subscribe if you aren't already and I'll see you guys next time.